Fears seem to come on as fast as those two blue lines show up on a pregnancy test. I can remember being a young mom, just finding out I was pregnant and fear overtaking me when I was in the car, realizing, oh my gosh, I have another human being in the car with me. I used to be alone and now there's two of us um, and worried about every other driver that was on the road. And as my children have grown and you know, the fears on the outside of you eventually, um, you realize that uh, they morph, the fears morph. It's not just for their physical safety, but then it's like their character, their spiritual development, like what's gonna happen to them? So I'll go from trying to manage and control their physical safety to, oh my gosh, am I ruining them as a parent? Like, I don't know what I'm doing here. I need help. And so um, the way that I've fought fear um, in, those, in those places physically, um, especially as I have a 14-year-old who is only years away from driving, and I know I cannot be there, um, the first thing for me was to realize that I have very little power over protecting them. Um, I have very little power over their lives. I can have self-control and I can um, dig into the Lord for my own sanctification and, and how I would parent them, but still that's just a small fraction of what I can do to help and protect my children. So starting there that God, you love them more than I could ever love them. And it's hard to fathom that. I can only begin to fathom that, but God, you you care for them and not only do you care for them but you are in charge of them you know that you I know that you will use even my weaknesses even things that might befall them that could potentially hurt them in some way that you can use it for their good that nothing is wasted and so I fight the fear by realizing I don't have control and praying asking the Lord Oh, I know you love them more. Would you protect them? Would you lead them? Would you use my shortcomings as a parent, my failures as a parent to show your unfailing, steadfast love for them? And so that's what I do. I do that's how I fight fears that try to consume me.